Let's turn now to Florida's Kennedy Space Center, where a SpaceX rocket just launched into orbit, its second attempt at liftoff after the historic mission had to be aborted on Saturday. NBC's Kerry Sanders is on the scene for us. Kerry, looks like a clean launch. Good morning, Willie. Yes, success, and it looks like all systems are now going in direction towards the space station. Let's watch the countdown on the liftoff. Four, three, two, one. Ignition and liftoff of the Falcon 9 to the space station on the first commercial launch from Kennedy Space Center's historic Pad 39A. And you heard that historic 39 uh, Pad A there. That is where the Apollo missions took off from, the ones that went to the moon. That's where the space shuttle, many of them, lifted off from. And now with that nostalgic pressure, success by SpaceX, a private contractor to NASA to deliver items to the International Space Station. Elon Musk, yesterday, there was a launch window, and even though the computer said it looked like everything was going to go, he hit the stop button because there was an indication of a steering mechanism problem that he wanted to have them review, so they spent the night looking at it, about 30 engineers, making sure that everything was good, and of course, we see it take off here successfully, and really the most important part about this is not only the successful takeoff, but also so the landing, if you look at this, the rocket actually it's came back down wheels. and landed on its heel, landing on its heel like a pencil on an eraser. Willie? Kerry Sanders at the Kennedy Space Center. Kerry, thanks so much. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.